The stats are in for the May market snapshot, so let's dive right in and start with 38 homes. Starting with the volume metrics, where we can see that closed contracts took a 10% dip year over year. This year, pending contracts exploded with a 128% increase when compared to May of last year. Now, this is due in part to the area seeing an increase in inventory when compared to last year. Transitioning over to value metrics, the most impressive number on this graphic today is a luxury Gulf front home selling at the Bluffs of Sandy Shores for $18.75 million, carrying the pricing ceiling for the month. Also want to point out that the pricing floor saw significant gains when compared to last year. Even though the pricing ceiling and the pricing floor saw gains when compared year over year, the average price per square foot held flat for the month of May when compared to last year. Now this would hint that on average, much larger homes are being sold in the area. Another key takeaway that I'm seeing that's not reflected in the data here is the average days on market is increasing across the board for homes and condos meaning that sellers that are looking to sell in 2024 need to partner with an experienced listing agent to determine a competitive price to enter the market at. Homes that are unique, priced accordingly, and have access to desirable amenities are still selling quickly, while homes that are priced above market comps with room for negotiation are what's driving the average days on market up. If you like real estate data, then give my page a follow, and I'll be back next month with another market snapshot.